Happening today, the U.S. Supreme Court will take up two cases on a controversial topic. The debate over employers offering health insurance that covers the cost of birth control. CBS 11 Stephanie Lucero is live in Dallas with a look ahead. Now, Oklahoma-based Hobby Lobby here says that it would have to pay more than a million dollars in fines each day if it violates the Obamacare laws as written right now. Planned Parenthood says this is a battle over women's access to contraception. Now, this was the scene at a rally at Clyde Warren Park in Dallas yesterday. A crowd of about 50 people, well, they are in support of a government mandate that employers offer health insurance covering contraception. The Affordable Care Act says companies need to provide health care that covers all forms of contraception at no cost. The owners of Hobby Lobby, a privately owned company, sued, saying that conflicts with their religious beliefs. It's not about... Uh, whether women can take it or not. We have, we're not kind, trying to control that. We're just trying to control our participation in it. And the worry is if they're allowed to discriminate against this health care decision that they don't agree with, what others will they be able to deny their employees in the future? Now, the owners of Hobby Lobby say they don't object to every part of the contraceptive mandate. Their lawyers say they oppose drugs or devices that end human life after conception. Live in Dallas, Stephanie Lucero, CBS 11 News. 